The following video contains content and or language which may be unsuitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Places everyone. Roll camera. Cue the shield. Uh, Scotty? Yeah, Sam? Where are the letters? In the mailbox. Ruffle, 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 ruffle. Scotty? <sighs> Here we go again. Sam berating Scotty for a simple little blooper. It's the same old song and dance. Sam first berates Scotty and then fires him. And then Scotty threatens to kill himself and Sam refuses to accept responsibility. And then Sam throws Scotty out the door. And Dave and or Mr. Warner bless Sam for firing Scotty and brings Scotty back. And Sam throws a tantrum over his authority being overridden. Sam, why don't you give up? Your berating Scotty for these bloopers is getting very boring. We're getting illness and fatigue from it. Illness and fatigue? We're sick and tired of it. Ha 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 So what's so boring about needing to have some authority over these videos? Don't you get it, Sam? Your treatment of Scotty is making us all bored, you hear me? Bored, bored, bored. Uh-oh. Ran over bored. It's all Beltsville, Sam. <laughs> I don't give a shit about boredom. I've had it with you, Scotty. Put me down. Shut up, Scotty. You're fired. Out you go. <laughs> what the hell do you mean wrongful termination? Scotty's firing is justified, you hear? Justified. Justified, my ass. You bring Scotty back here right now, or I'll tell Mr. Warner on you! You'll do nothing of the kind. If you dare bring Scotty back, I'll kill you, you understand? I'll kill you. Don't you threaten Dave, Sam. You know I love him. How dare you refuse to bring Scotty back? You know I love him. Bring him back. Never. He's banned from here forever, and if you make one false move, I'll kill you. <laughs> You'll do nothing of the kind, Sam. Drop the gun and bring Scotty back. But Mr. Warner, how else can I exert authority around here without Dave Madsen's interference? And don't you dare overstep the bounds of your authority again. That's telling you, Mr. Warner. By the way, this is the first time we've seen you in person in our videos. The intercom's out for repairs. Do I get my job back? Yes, Scotty. Now get back to work. Roger, Dodger. How dare you interfere with my authority, Dave? I've got a good mind to charge you with mutiny. Mutiny, mutiny. Stop acting like a control freak or else. No, Mr. Warner. Don't nail me to the WB shield again. You want all the Christians in the world to aid you. No, Sam. I'm not nailing you to the WB shield again. Then what will you do with me? Does this answer your question, Microsoft Sam? Put me down. Microsoft Sam, you're fired! Out you go! Thank you, Mr. Warner. You saved my job as well as my life. You're welcome, Scotty. Come back to work. I don't want you getting into any more trouble. Will do, Mr. W. I'm so glad you're back, Scotty. I love you. I love you too. All right, who said in the exploding shield? Not me. Not me. Not me. Not me. Somebody here is lying. Not me. Not me. Not me. Not me. One of you is lying. Who did it? Nobody's lying, Dave. 
None of us would even think of planting a bomb here. Learn out and Hobsky, Michael and I are artisans, not terrorists. We're peaceful people here, Dave. The only bombs we make would be really terrible videos. <laughs> The Mad Bomber strikes again. That's three times the shield exploded. So who could be the Mad Bomber? Here's a clue, Dave. I found a note here. What does it say, Anna? To whom it may concern, I planted that bomb in the WB shield to show you that you haven't heard the last of me. Signed, Microsoft Sam. Sam planted that bomb? I should have known that Control Freak would be behind this. Who does he think he is, Major Needle Hassan? No, I am not Major Hassan, I am Microsoft Sam. And I took the liberty of filing a wrongful termination lawsuit against you, Mr. Warner. That lawsuit is only gonna be frivolous, Sam. If you think you can stoop to terrorism to con me into rehiring you just so you can abuse Radar Overseer Scotty again, you've got another thing coming. If you don't rehire me, Mr. Warner, I'll send the devil and she-devil after you. Those infernal imps. They always soil the place every time they show up. Will you rehire me? When hell freezes over. All right, Mr. Warner, you asked for it. Oh no! Not the devil and she devil again! Save us, Jesus! Don't mention that name in front of us. It always makes our tails grow in. What is the meaning of this, Sam, summoning up the devil and she devil as a ruse to get me to rehire you? If you don't rehire me, Mr. Warner, I'll remind them that you mailed me to the WB Shield twice. And get them to torment Mr. Warner? I've got a good mind to call on God and the Angel to teach these infernal imps a lesson! Dave, you always flatter us. I think you have what it takes to be one of us, Dave. How about, after you finish this video, you and I spend the night in a private spot? Really, she-devil? You're a little too dangerous for me. What's going on here? Are you two infernal imps bothering Dave Madison and his friends again? Don't you know that'll only incur my wrath? Why must you always interfere? Why don't you leave us alone? It's about time God and the angel showed up. I hope they teach the devil and she-devil a lesson. So do I, so Mr. Warner and I can reach a deal for me to return to work. One false move, Microsoft Sam, and I'll call a Lady Gaga. Don't mention that harlot's name to me again. I hate her, you hear me? I hate her, I hate her, I hate her. Lady Gaga, Lady Gaga, Lady Gaga, Lady Gaga. Stop it. You heard him, she-devil. Stop tormenting Sam. Mr. Warner, we are gonna tell everyone in the world that you may have sent to the WB Shield twice. Well, I'm not bringing Sam back, and I can have gotten the angel give you the business. That, Mr. Warner, will be regarded by the she devil and I as scandalous and nothing else but scandalous. Unless you admit you defame Christianity, Mr. Warner, we will shit all over you. That's disgusting. If you do that, God and the angel will punish you. That's enough out of you. Shall we let Mr. Warner have it? Let's do it. Bombs away. Yeah. You vile, disgusting crap machines. You. Eee. Now look what you did. You made Mr. Warner sick. For this you are gonna get it. Take that. alone together just once. Oh, my aching sphincter. Ah, uh, what? The angel cleaned up Mr. Warner, who apologized to Sam for his past transgressions. Sam dropped his lawsuit and agreed to return to work. And the Looney Tunes intro bloopers continue. Looney Tunes presents
which featured character would show up next? Bugs Bunny? Daffy Duck? Elmer Fudd? Speedy Gonzalez? Probably Pepe Le Pew, because, as Sam would say, this blooper stinks. You bet your sweet Chuck Jones it would. <laughs> They're playing my song again. You always say that, Mary. Doesn't it ever get old? Sorry. Old habits die hard. Warner Brothers presents That's All Folks. That's the shortest cartoon in history. Uh oh. Me thinks I goofed again. You think's right, Scotty, but I guess you should get another chance. Uh, not now, Sam. It's getting late. Let's pick things up in the morning. Boom! Boom!